ghosts are real. I've seen them all my life. Guillermo del Toro turns his hand to gothic melodrama with Crimson Peak. An American heiress falls for a mysterious English aristocrat, but he and his scheming sister are hiding a terrible secret. You see where I come from? Ghosts are not to be taken lightly. I understand your fascination with the Sharps. Edith, this is my sister. But proceed with caution. I feel as if a, a link exists between your heart and mine. It's a sumptuously beautiful film. I hope when people see this film, they'll see Guillermo's unbelievable attention to detail. Um, there's such precision in it. The ghosts are inspired by the mummified people, the Vogue people. They were found in black mud, and they came out all distorted and black. And I thought, well, if the mud and if the clay under the house is red, the ghost would be red. And that connects them with Lucille. So I'm going to make sure Lucille has red details. And that's how it is. Mia Vashikowska plays new bride Edith, Jessica Chastain, her sister-in-law, Lucille. They had this idea that uh, Edith was a butterfly and, and Lucille was a moth, and then sort of echoing that in the shape of our costumes and, and the colours. It was really beautiful. Thomas! Has anyone died in this house? The haunted house was a warm, cosy set, but Del Toro needed shots outside too in the Canadian winter. It was truly brutal. And when we went through it, there was wind, hurricane level wind combined with the cold. There was a moment where a giant silk came flying and snapped uh, six steel cables and came flying, almost crushing the crew. You do an action movie and nothing happens. You make a gothic melodrama and you're almost killed. <laughs> Tom Hiddleston had something extra to keep his mind off the cold, preparing for his upcoming Hank Williams biopic. Learning how to play and sing like Hank Williams isn't something you can do quickly. So I knew that I had to, you know, my downtime, I had to sort of to play and sing as much as I can. And somewhere there is a, there is a, there is a video of me playing Long Gone Lonesome Blues, dressed as Thomas Sharp, which is so sort of, uh, which is such a, uh, a, such a random thing. But actually, it's, I must dig it up. It's hilarious. It's in my computer somewhere. Everything on screen in Crimson Peak is gorgeous, except for the twists. It's pretty but predictable. 